we're going to take a look at the iPhone's Messages application. If we open the Messages app, here we'll be taken to our most recent conversation we've been having with our friend. If we scroll down, we can see our conversation. If we press Edit in the top right hand corner, we can select Messages to delete or forward, or if we wanted to, we can press Clear All in the top left hand corner. If we'd like to reply to the message, just press the Message field and begin typing our message. If we wanted to add an emoji, all we have to do is press the world button in the lower left hand corner and we can select from a different emojis in our emoji menu. The world button is also where any other language keyboards will be. If we tap and hold on the world button, we can also see a list of the keyboards that we have on our iPhone. If we press the Numbers button in the lower left hand corner, we can be taken to our Numbers and Characters keyboard. And once we're ready to send it, all we have to do is press Send and our message will be sent. If we wanted to add a photo or a video, all we have to do is press the camera icon on the left hand side of the message field and we can take a photo or video or we choose from our camera roll. If we go to the main messages field by hitting messages in the top left hand corner we'll be able to see all the conversations we're having with all of our friends. If we press the new message button in the top right hand corner we'll be taken to a new message sheet where we can add in the phone number or the contact we'd like to send a message to then all we have to do is type our message in the message field and then once we're ready to send it all we have to do is press send.